If you could make your plea to the NCAA tournament committee about getting that four seed, especially when they take in consideration injured players and such, what would you tell them about getting that number four seed so Arizona can get potentially a couple of home games in the NCAA tournament? I would say we deserve that four seed. Um, we're not healthy right now, but we put our work in the whole year. Um, we have an incredible environment where I'd be shocked if we didn't sell out, which is really good for our game. And, um, you know, we're a good team. That we've, we've had some bad losses lately, but we've beat some really good teams throughout the year. And I, the first one I can name is Louisville, but there's a list of them. So we deserve to be in a tournament. We deserve a seed. Um, and we're going to have Kate back. Oh, what a run by Arizona. And that was Adia Barnes after the loss in the Pac-12 tournament over a week ago. I asked her to make her case for the Wildcats, and she did it then in the NCAA selection committee. Confirmed today, the Arizona Wildcats women's basketball team did deserve a four seed. And now, Tucson will be rewarded by the U of A potentially hosting two games at McHale Center in the NCAA tournament. Welcome back, my friends. I'm Paul Cicala. David Kelly has the weekend off. All the fan fiesta begins at McHale Center on Saturday as the Wildcats will host UNLV. And I can already tell you this will be lots of fun. It'll pit family against family, sister against sister. Yes, Arizona senior Sam Thomas is from Las Vegas, and she'll take on her hometown team, UNLV. And you guessed it, Thomas will play against her sister, Jade. I caught up with Sam Thomas' sister in Las Vegas when Jade had a day off from her UNLV practice, and she told me about how much she looks up to her big sis, Sam. And now they'll face each other on the court at Mikkel Center this Saturday. <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing my family all together, of course, and finally putting to use their UNLV half Arizona shirts that we got them for Christmas. <laughs> it's extremely important to host. We need to sell out McHale. It is a huge home court advantage. This is one of the toughest venues in America to play in, so we need fans to come out. We need to be 15,000 strong. I'm very excited to be hosting. I know we were kind of worried about where we were going to be, if we were hosting or not, so to see the four next to our name. Super happy, and as a senior, to be playing here again for hopefully two more games. Bear down. Hey, I also challenge all of the U of A fans. That means you turn on out to McHale Center this weekend. Support the Wildcat women's basketball team. Let's see a sellout on Saturday and potentially Monday at McHale Center in the round of 32. Can't wait. Hey, we're far from over with as both Coach Adia Barnes and Tommy Lloyd work diligently to get their teams ready for the big dance coming up after the break. Fresh off of sweeping the Pac-12 regular season title and taking home all the glory in Vegas at the conference tournament. The Wildcats talk about their number one seed in the NCAA tournament. And then some. More sports, more energy, more basketballing after the break. <laughs> 